to take you home to the train station last year? Probably, yeah. I come back from that Christmas. courtyard, it would have yeah. been, yeah. Hmm. I would imagine so. Definitely, I hadn't been there for since last year. I think that sounds about right. <laughs> oh my god, Apple, no, come on. What you called your dog? Apple. <laughs> apple, who named that? <laughs> she's got a little head like an apple. <laughs> Her body's so tiny and she's got this great big head. She doesn't make any sense. What sort of dog is it? She's a little chihuahua. Oh, right. Handbag dog. <laughs> well, it wasn't meant to be. I was meant to get a proper dog and then I met her and she needed a home and I just thought, whoa. Are you re- is it a rehomed dog? Is she's not rehomed, but she was... The owner wasn't a breeder. She just had a lot of dogs and she couldn't have any more and one had puppies. Right. So... Whilst I did buy her, I normally would try and get a rehomed one. Yeah. Um, I just, I couldn't, oh, I didn't want her to go anywhere else. I just fell in love with her, as you do with Have dogs. Have got a bag where you carry her around? In? She's in a bag now. <laughs> Typical London girl. I know. I, well, she does walk, but when it's really busy, she's ever so tiny, so I just make sure so she's... Whose fault is that? Is that yours or the dog? It's my fault. <laughs> He's pampering his dog too much. Well, listen to her. I think she likes it. I think she's used to it. Can you imagine being carried around in a shearling sleeping bag all day? It sounds all right to me. <laughs> Just woken up for food and cuddles. Yeah, I reckon I could hack that. Yeah, it's the life for me. <laughs> so embarrassing. She does this in my office and I'll be <laughs> busy like, leading. Taking work, yeah. yeah. She just runs around. Or not. She's... And everybody else. <laughs> everyone loves her, but then she starts snoring and everyone turns around and looks at me. And so, look at you. <laughs> so, what's going on there? <laughs> Hello. Oh, you're awake now. I'm awake, Mum. She keeps laughing. She's awake. She's, she's giving me the side eye now. What are you laughing at? No, back to sleep now. No. And back. <laughs> oh. really... uh, apparently, there'll be more people shopping today than what there would be Christmas Eve. Oh, apparently. really? That's what they said on the radio earlier on. Ooh, I picked a good day to go shopping then, didn't I? If yeah, you're used to this sort of traffic. Oh, yeah, no, this is pretty. It's normal to you. This is, yeah, this is light. <laughs> <laughs> this is fine. Try and drive through Soho at 8.30 in the morning. Ooh. No thanks. No, thank you. There's only one good thing about Soho. There's an honest burger near it. Oh, that is true. That is lovely. There's an honest burger now in Cambridge. Is there? Yeah, Cambridge has changed burger. a lot. There's all sorts here now. Because I haven't lived this, in this Cambridge. This is the first one, this is the first honest burger they've ever had out of London. Is and it? I've been all of them in London. Oh, it is so good. I go to Wembley to see England quite a lot of football. Yeah. Um, we park up at Wembley at sort of ten in the morning. Yeah. And then we get the, the tube back and we have co- we go to Covent Garden. Yeah. And, and then we have to go to Dean Street. To get your honest burger. Your honest burger <laughs> before we go back to football. That's amazing. It's a given. It's a great day. God, it's tasty. It's amazing it's how you now. can make just a simple burger. With them tasty. rosemary chips. Oh, that's sauce. it. It's the chips. And, oh. and then that bacon gravy. How they are just. It's amazing. I get it delivered to my house because you can get it on um, delivery or Uber Eats. Yeah, those rosemary chips are amazing. (laughs) I try not to too often, otherwise (laughs) be the size of a house if I keep doing it. But they're so yummy. Can't help yourself. You still filming? 